Good morning, guys. Happy Sunday. It's Jesus Day for people who do that. Um, I don't go to church personally, but um, it is what it is. Coming back to you with a Chrysos update. Got some exciting news for Chrysos. Very exciting news. Um, so if you've been watching my videos on Chrysos, uh, you would know that my uh, would or my interest value has been at negative nineteen dollars and eighty seven cents uh, for like the past two weeks. Um, so I heard a, a dirty rumor today that uh, Chrysos was alive. And was paying. And everything was going really, really good with Chrysos right now. You know, so I figured I'd call that dude's bullshit. And I went, what? Okay, that was weird. <laughs> Technical issues. You know, so I hopped on to check it out. And boom, look at this. $263 in returns and 42 cents. Don't forget that. Um, so that's a couple weeks worth of interest. So, I, you know, they were earning the whole time. They just, they were having some kind of bug with at least some of their accounts. I know some people were getting their interest every day. Other people's, you know, were getting them, getting interest every, you know, I don't know, three or four days they get a chunk of interest. You know, and I had gone like two whole weeks without seeing any change. Um, so this, you know, and I was making about $15 a day or so in interest. And that, that's exciting right there. So that's, that's about a couple weeks worth, um, which is about how long it's been since I've gotten a return. Now, I'm going to keep this $263, you know, I'm going to watch it grow. I am not going to hit this yet. And I'm not going to hit this yet. <clears throat> um, because Chrysos is supposed to go on the external exchanges soon. Um, I, If I remember correctly, March 5th was their target date for external exchanges. And then the $14 price lock Right, so if you go to the exchange, you know they they've completely locked their prices, right, for initial trades for like three weeks. It's a pretty long initial trade period, but they've locked their price at fourteen dollars. Okay, and I think I really hope they unlock that soon because um, that is a big part of what's killing their platform right now is there is zero growth, zero change, and it's locked. So there's no opportunity for growth. You know, there's no opportunity for it to drop down so people can buy, right? <clears throat> there's none of that happening. So I, I really hope that they unlock that soon, although I have not seen anything that says that they're going to um, in the near future. But once it opens on an external exchange, they don't have a choice. They have to unlock it because... <laughs> <laughs> because they have no control over external, the price on the external. Um, but uh, once that happens, you're going to see that $14 price point drop significantly. You know, I would not at all be surprised to see it like less than a dollar, um, especially considering what's been happening with it lately. You know, um, I'm really hoping that once it unlocks, people don't just start trying to sell all the damn Chrysos they have and drive this thing down to zero. Um, but keep in mind, when you're selling and driving that price down, somebody else is buying those things. So we'll see where it's at. But um, personally, I'm kind of thinking around 50 cents, maybe even a quarter, um, as kind of like a, you know how Thorn, they kind of stabilized around $1.50 in, in the past 24 hours or so. You know, that's kind of where it's been. It's jumped up a little bit. It's jumped down a little bit. It's come back to $1.50. But it's kind of it's kind of hanging tight at, at around $1.50 or so. Um, I think that threshold is going to be $0.50 cents or a quarter or something like that. Less than a dollar for Crisos. 
Um, anyway, once that stabilizes and this goes away, um, <clears throat> that is when I'm going to click the withdraw button, right y'all? Because if I do it right now, it's going to give me 263 divided by $14. You know, so I'd be looking at, you know, I don't know, 17 or 18 Creso, something like that. Uh, whereas if I wait for the market to, you know, determine a, a true price point for this stuff, you know, let's just say it's a dollar, I'll get 263 Cresos. I started with 71 of these things. I did not really have the budget for this. Um, it was my referral commissions from Thorncoin. I got one referral commission from them. Uh, for about a hundred bucks, and that's what I used to buy into Cresos. Um, obviously, I got in kind of late on the ICO. I think I bought in around a buck twenty, uh, but I got uh, like seventy one of these things. So that'd be pretty nice for me if it comes down to a dollar. And I started with seventy one. Now I've got two hundred and sixty three of these things. You know, that'd be cool for me. And then you know, um, I'm not expecting Cresos to hit. You know, two or three hundred dollars. Um, I just don't really see that happening, especially with them fumbling the ball uh, on the opening kickoff there. Um, <clears throat> so, but you know, I think if, if it gets up to ten or fifteen dollars, that'd be good enough for me. I'd be happy with that. Um, you know, but and and keep in mind if it's. 50 cents is the price when I withdraw. It's going to be double that, so I'll have a little over 500. And if it's a quarter, then I would have, you know, right around 1,000, um, like 1,200 or something like that. You know, so it makes sense to wait until the price is true so you actually get the full value of this. Because if I do this now, I'm going to get, you know, 17 or 18 of those Cresos. Um, and then once I can do anything with those Cresos, that might be $17. It might be $5, you know, like of, of value for those tokens. So I'm going to wait. I'm not going to withdraw. I'm going to wait for the price to steady out um, so I can get the true value of my Cresos tokens. Um, you know, and then, shoot, if I've got a 1,000 of these things, I might wait till the price hits you know, I don't know, 10 or $15 and, and then loan half and sell the other half and call it, call it a huge win, you know, because remember, I got into this for free. I'm playing with Thorne's money on this, <laughs> you know, so if it's, you know, if, hell, even if I only get 263 of them, right, and I loan out 150 of them at $15, that's still a pretty good uh, little loan there. You know, and then I sell the other 113 for, uh, you know, a grand, 1100 bucks for free. That's a damn good hit. <clears throat> you know, it's not as huge, crazy of a hit as some of these numbers that you see when we're playing around with Thorn, but that's okay. You know, um, this one was always kind of a sleeper, um, at least until the Oracle started doing his uh, Crease host giveaways. Uh, there was a lot more interest gathered after that, but it still did not have nearly the exposure as uh, Thorn and some of these other platforms have had. You know, so I'm going to be conservative with Creasos, uh once it starts happening, and that's fine because you know I technically yes I paid a hundred dollars into it because I could have just pocketed that hundred dollars, um, but. That wasn't money I was expecting to have anyway, you know, so why not give Cresos a shot? Uh, but for those who are heavily invested, and I do have a very good personal friend who did uh, go into Cresos kind of big, um, this is outstanding news. And to you, buddy, go look in your lending right now. Uh, go see what it's sitting at. Um, so Cresos is alive. It's, it's doing things. I don't know if this, you know, uh, new development team that they rumored to, blah, 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 they were rumored to have, 
I don't know if this is them. You know, I don't know if uh, they finally just found the bug that was fucking with them and uh, fixed it, you know, and that whole development team was just, you know, they're putting something out there so people wouldn't completely lose faith. You know, I don't really care, to be honest. You know, what, what they do is their business. What I care about is money in my pocket, right? Putting money in my pocket. So do I care? Yes, to an extent. But do I truly care what they're doing with their business? Like who's running it? You know, what's, they change their, you know, chain of command. I, I, I don't. Not really, you know, um, especially because when that happened, there was nothing going on with Crisos, so it couldn't have been any worse, you know, um, so it doesn't matter to me. Um, as long as this continues to go up, which I'm hoping that it will, especially because it went up by so much. This wasn't just, you know, hey, you got a day's worth of interest, you know, because I did get a day's worth of interest uh, here and there. But so I'm, I'm really hoping that they've gotten their stuff figured out. I'm really hoping that they do the right thing, the smart thing, and go ahead and ax this freaking $14 price lock because that is killing him. You know, there's no room for growth. There's no room for profit, you know. It's the exact same price right now as it was two weeks ago. You know, and there are, there are a lot of people out there that look to day trade cryptocurrencies, you know, so they're thinking that it's going to be, you know, it's a dollar right now in the morning, you know, by mid afternoon, you know, they think it's going to be worth a dollar 20 or a dollar 25. So they buy a bunch of them at a dollar and then try and sell them at a dollar 25 and take that profit, you know, or whatever their thing is, you know, that's, that's actually a pretty good profit for day trading. 25%, but you know, they think it's going to be a dollar 10 or, you know, a dollar 06, you know, so they'll, they'll uh, do short term stuff, you know, and that accounts for a lot of volume That accounts for a lot of volume, people looking to do that kind of stuff. Uh, it's not necessarily the greatest for the platform itself, but it will bring more volume to the platform, which is what Crisos desperately needs. So, um, Holy shit, did that thing just go away? Did the price just go away? The lock? Nope. Damn. Okay. Maybe I hit the X and, and didn't even think about it. Yeah. Um, this needs to go. That, that's got to go, guys. Um, and there's a few other things that need to happen with Crisos, but that's, that's a good starting point right there. Um, so, anyway, if you're in Crisos, go check your accounts. Uh, I got the two weeks worth of interest, you know, which it's that's about right for my calculations on that thousand dollar loan. What I should be expecting to make every month, you know, right around four hundred fifty dollars is what I'm expecting, you know. So that's that's about right, uh, right on track there. That's all I got for now. Stay tuned. Um, I'm kicking around ideas for a GMT video, but. With that, it's not as complicated. There's not as many options <laughs> as there is with lending ICOs. It's basically you, you either mine with them or you sell them. <laughs> so that's, <laughs> you know, there's not a whole lot of different stuff you can do. Um, but um, I was thinking about kicking around that idea on what to do with them. I might hold off until the uh, ICO is done and everyone has an idea of how many tokens they have and then start doing some videos on some things that you can do with them to maybe maximize your profit, you know, so that you can plug your own numbers in there, whatever you happen to get. Um, I don't know, still in the works. Um, I'm on daddy duty today, so I may not have a lot of time to make videos, but it is what it is, guys. You know, I'm, I'm absolutely loving this crypto journey so far. Um, it's very exciting. I mean, it's it's a lot of fun. It is. I like it a lot. Um, and I really hope you guys do, too. Um, <clears throat> one thing it does take, though, is it does take steady hands. And you, got, you can't let your fear control you because if you do, you know, you're, you're screwing yourselves. Because 
I could go ahead and I could sell every throne I've got right now. <clears throat> and it would still be for a profit. Um, well, no, it wouldn't because I, I goofed and bought those $408. Um, but if I hadn't done that, if I had just gotten in on the ICO, I could sell everything I've got right now for a profit, right? But the money that you could make doing that is a drop in the fucking bucket compared to what you could make if this thing even goes a quarter as high as everyone thinks it's going to. You know, so a lot of people seem to think it's going to be $400, you know, soon. Not, not today, not tomorrow, not next week, but you know, within the next month or two. There's a lot of people that believe that. You know, and if it even does a quarter as well as that, $100. You know, that's life-changing for something that you got into for a dollar or less. You know, it's 100 times whatever you put into it. That is insane. You know, nowhere else that I know of is that possible in the, in the time frame that we're looking at here. Now, obviously, if you went back in time and bought into Apple... When it first opened up, you'd be looking pretty good right now. But <laughs> that's completely different. That's over 50 years. You know, we're talking six months or less in crypto. It's it's quick. It's insane, you know. And there is that dangerous element out there, you know, all the scammers, you know, which I hate getting scammed. But, I mean, it adds a level of excitement to this thing. <laughs> you know, uh, Wall Street's pretty boring. You know, you can make a lot of money there, but it's pretty dry and it's pretty boring. You know, crypto is anything but boring, and I love that. So thank you guys for everything that y'all do. I love watching the view counts. I love uh, when I get a new subscriber. I love the comments. You know, it really brightens my day. So thanks for everything that you guys have done, and I definitely don't plan on being... I don't plan on going anywhere. You know, I, I'm going to keep doing this kind of stuff, you know, and I'm going to keep talking about the programs that I believe in, you know, and that I'm investing in. So stay tuned. I'll catch you guys next time. Hopefully it's another one later today, but we'll see how little man's acting. Have a good Sunday, guys.